Morning, Park Yav. Welcome to our small group question video for January the 30th. If you're in church today, uh, you'll know that we talked about David and Goliath and the challenges that Goliath posed to both Saul and David and saw how they reacted and acted in that situation. Uh, it's, it's oftentimes that we face Goliaths in our lives all the time. Just big, huge problems that invade our space, take over our lives, and paralyze us. And, uh, and that's what happened to Saul. That's what we saw Goliath do in his life. But then we saw Goliath's presence do something very different to David, the man of God. And today in your small groups, you're going to discuss a little bit about that. How when problems invade your life, what do you do? I know for myself, I often worry way before I pray. And, uh, and that's, uh, that's not good. David had such a spiritual reaction to this physical problem. And it's, uh, it's a great reminder that, that we fight a spiritual battle. It's not just the physical problems that we're presented with. The enemy, our enemy, the devil, is prowling around like a lion looking for someone to devour. And, uh, and every problem that we face is at base a spiritual problem, which is what David attacked this as, right? So we're going to talk about how people, how what problems do to our lives, um, when people speak evil of the Lord, uh, how we react to that, like David reacted quite strongly. Uh, we're going to talk a little bit about the Great Commission because that's our mission and it's kind of daunting when we see the enemy prowling around and, and when we think about what people will think of us when we share Jesus with them. We'll talk about uh, how, how daily our spiritual battle is and if we even think and consider that, maybe we need to do something about that. And then also, uh, if you can take some time and share together about some of the Goliaths that are in your life and pray together about those things as a house church, that would be excellent because then we are sharing with one another. We're taking away some of the power that the enemy has in us by keeping us ashamed or humiliated and, uh, and start to attack these problems together as a body and, uh, and, and looking at them in a spiritual sense, not just a physical sense. I hope you guys have a great meeting. Take care. God bless.